Good morning, everybody. Welcome. We are, are now at the Thomas United Methodist Church in Kennel, Louisiana, and today is the 20th of December, and Christmas is right around the corner, and we're about to have a toy giveaway sponsored by the good folks here at Thomas United Methodist. We'll get started in just a moment. As you can see, we have Santa's list over here, and our kids that are on the list will, of course, be showered with some of the presents and toys that we have assembled.
Someone's driveway. I'm not sure where you are. Oh, yeah. All right, yeah. I'm Sabrina Short. I'm married to that guy over there, and I'm a member of Agape Four. And we're gonna do a little worship before we begin. Amen. Amen. Yeah. We're called the Agape Four and the Organic Praise Band.
have to give it back. Amen? Amen.
You know why I am not going to say. It did a beautiful job. Another half case. out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. Today, in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloth and lying in a manger. Suddenly, a great company of the heavenly hosts appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven and on earth. Peace to those whom his favor rests. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let's go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened which the Lord has told us about. So they hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby who was lying in the manger. When they had seen him, they spread the word concerning what had been told to them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds said to them. But Mary treasured up all these things and pounded them in her heart. The shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen, which were just as they had been told. Amen. Always believe that their little angels are special indeed, and they could grow up to be anything. But who would imagine a king? A shepherd or teacher is what you could be, or maybe a fisherman out on the sea, or maybe a carpenter building things, or who would imagine a king? It all seems so clear. When the wise men arrived and the angels were singing your name, the world would be different because you were alive. That's why heaven stood still to proclaim. One day an angel said quietly that soon he would bring something special to me but of all of the wonderful gifts he would bring who would imagine a king who would imagine a king like to introduce to you on the paper it says a representative from Dollar General but we would like to introduce to you an angel Jenny Chippendo Good morning, everyone. I'd like to first thank you all for allowing me and my team at Dollar General to take part in this. Um, 
This is our third year representing here at Thomas United Methodist Church. Um, fourth year actually working with Sabrina. Uh, I can remember four years ago around Christmas time, I was reaching out to the community and making phone calls to find someone that was willing to take the toy donations from my store. Several people I reached out to was not interested or um, just, you know, basically I couldn't find anybody. So I pulled out the phone book and searched through the yellow pages and ran across Fountain of Youth Foundation. And I sat at my desk in my office and I was hoping someone would answer with joyful, you know, appreciation and eagerness to help the community. And this voice on the other phone, on the other line, proclaimed they were excited to take the donations. And from that moment, Sabrina and I have partnered up. This is the fourth year. Um, a lot of progress, a lot of growth in this program. Um, and I hope this time next year will be even larger. Um, I'm reaching out to the other Dollar General stores in our, in our community to try to help build this so that this place will be packed or maybe you will have to find a different place to have it, Sabrina, because we'll have too many people. So this is the growth and the joy of this. It's very special and passionate to me. Um, I grew up with a very rough childhood. So this, I love to see the smiles on the children's faces. And from my store and from the people who made the donations possible, we wish you a Merry Christmas. And hope you all enjoy it. All right, Miss Jenny, don't go too far. This is the moment everybody's been waiting for. So I want to know from the children here, if you're under 18, who's been good this year? <laughs> you sure? then you're on Santa's list. And so that means you get a Christmas present. Amen? Yeah. Who's ready? Me. Who's ready? Me. All right. So we're going to call your name. And then when we call your name, we want you to come up, the child only. And if your child is not here, the parent or guardian may um, get the present on their behalf but we encourage the children to come up and get their own gifts, okay? All right, so we're going to start calling. My greeters, you guys have a checklist for me? Thank you. Oh, an announcement straight from the North Pole saying that please do not open your presents here. Take them home and wait till Christmas Day and put them under your tree. Each present has been personally picked and wrapped and selected just for you. So we want to make sure that you take that time out on Christmas Day to open it then, okay? All right, so we're going to get going. Gonna start and you want to call it, and then uh, what do you got first? Who do you want to pay first? And I'll check it. Cameron. Cameron A. Cameron A. Cameron A. Are you Cameron A? What's your last name? Okay, that's not an A. Okay, so where's Cameron A? Oh, Cameron A. All right, Merry Christmas. The presents are bigger than you. He must really was good. You were extra good, if someone said. <laughs> hey, 
Anthony B. Okay. I see Anthony B. I see you check off here. Anthony. Anthony. B. Is your last initial? Is it? It's Anthony D. Like dog. You don't have one Anthony, so that's probably Come on, Anthony. Yay. Sometimes the elves didn't wear their glasses when they write the name down. That's okay. Chloe, we'll just call him because is Chloe here? A Mary C. Mary C. No Mary? Where's my other L? Cameron B. All right, we got Cameron B. Cameron B. Merry Christmas. We gonna get it. We gonna get it. Archie E. Kayla or Kyla B, K Y L A. Oh, Jerry C. Wait, who, what's your name, babe? What's your last name? P. No. See, that's okay. Listen for your initial. Ignatius D, like dog. Ignatius. Ignatius. Reginald C. Reginald C. Okay. Is there a Reginald C? I'll put that on my front. Samai B. S Y M A I D. Latoya B. When I call your name, raise your hand so I know that you're coming. Tyrone B. Tyrone B. Tion, T-E-I-O-N-B. So you raise your hand so I can see you. Don't miss you. Jerry C. Kyle C. 
Kyle C. Make sure you raise your hand so I can see you. Oh, I know who this is. Win 10. Uh-oh, 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 go to the next, oh! Grandma on his phone. Alonzanae C. Alonzanae, A-L-O-N-Z-N-A-E. Oh, that's when they're all together. Quentin H. Ooh! Merry Christmas, Quentin. Myson E M Myson. Thank you for raising your hand. Yay! Merry Christmas. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it's another big one. Elijah J E L I J H A. Yay! Wave it like this. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. Merry Christmas. Casey C. Casey with a K. C. It's the last initial. Yay. We see. With a K. Ready? 
Emmanuel King. All right. Jordan M. Mm -hmm. 